And now it's time for the mix. Warning on this story. It may make you cry. It's so heartwarming. Grandma Boop, 83 years old. Uh. For the past 30 years, all she's ever wanted was to be in the Macy's Day Parade, which is on Thanksgiving Day. She has wanted this so badly. And take a look at what her family did for her. You're going to actually be in the parade. How can I be in the parade? We got you in the parade. How did you get me? Oh. Am I really in the parade? <laughs> You're in the parade. <laughs> Grandma Boop, you deserve it. You are really going to be in the parade. It's so good. As I, a clown. It just as a clown. As a clown, you're going to be a clown. You'll have Look to at the turkey. I love her outfit right there. And you can just see that for years she wanted this, and look, she gets it. <laughs> but I love that turkey hat. I want one of those. I like how she knows. How's that going to happen? I know. How are you going to make it happen? No, but they made it happen. They I can't did. wait to see her in that. Okay, another in of our Thanksgiving edition of the mix. How about this? JetBlue and Zappos surprising Thanksgiving travelers as they come to the airport. Check this out. They had this. Uh, essentially, it's a, a game of baggage roulette. There they are. Okay. They put the little labels there on what people win, and if your bag lands on it, you win a prize. Ooh. Take a look. There's somebody who won like a free round ship from JetBlue. And so doesn't that make the baggage claim experience just so exciting? Look at that. Sure. Yeah. You win all kinds of prizes. Now this has happened. This happened at Travelers uh, arriving at Terminal 5 in New York's JFK Airport ah. on Wednesday. But this is the best experience ever in baggage claim. Oh, sure. Until they tell you it's $50 to get your prize. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> I'm just kidding. They didn't charge that we know of. Oh but, you know, some of us are still a little bitter about this baggage claim. A little raw on the bag fee <laughs> thing over here. But that was a sweet gesture, I have to say. Well, there is an animal shelter in Roanoke, Virginia, that mm. really made a push this Thanksgiving to try and get 25 of their animals adopted. Take a look at some of these cute furry animals. Oh, adorable. Their goal was 25. We found out tonight they did 30. Applicants were able to name their price for their new pets, kind of like Priceline for pets. <laughs> I love a, that, though. It's sweet. Pets yeah. finding homes is what it's all about. And apparently they want to help the shelter make room for animals. This was the first couple to actually have adopted any of the animals overnight. Mm. And the shelter wants to make room for animals because there are a lot more that are coming later in the holiday season, usually. So. Oh, my gosh. I love it. Love it. Yep. Okay, got one more for you. Spotify is doing something to make your turkey just perfect. It's called Spotify's Time for Turkey. What you do is you list the amount of pounds. They're right there on Spotify. You select the mood, and it creates a playlist for the length of time you have to have that turkey oh. in the oven. You can let your freak flag fry right in that kitchen. Freak flag fly? What? Yes, right in that kitchen. <laughs>